Yeah. About six people die a year trying to eat this right here. What up, y'all? I'm Timothy Delaghetto, and this is Acquired Taste. I'm in beautiful K-Town, Los Angeles, Koreatown, where you can find anything, bro. You got the most fire Korean food out here. You got Korean barbecue. You can go to a late night karaoke spot and party till like 5 a.m. You got the whole world at your fingertips out here. And arguably, I've heard that you can get better food in Koreatown than you can get in Korea. So I'm excited to see what we have in store. I'm on a mission to find the most interesting food in the world and eat it with my unsuspecting homies. It's, it's a, a guinea pig? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Today, I'm gonna invite my boy Trevor Wallace to come eat some live octopus with me. He's a YouTuber, comedian, just a pretty white boy who needs to cut the energy drinks and try this natural source of power. Koreans believe eating live octopus is a way to build strength and stamina. Live octopus, also known as Sanakji, originated in South Korea. It's usually a snack accompanied by soju, a popular Korean liquor. Although the octopus is cut up and dead, the tentacles continue to wiggle and suction for about an hour or so due to continuing nerve activity. This snack is also a choking hazard. About six people a year die from choking on the tentacles. So now I'm excited to go to Wasada and try this live octopus. And we gonna go in the kitchen and see how they prepare it and all that. Oh man, look at that. I don't even know what that is, bro. Thank you, Mr. Octopus, for giving me your life energy. I appreciate you. This is the behind the scenes action, y'all. The exclusive right now. Oh, wow. Cut the head right off. Just twisted the head right off. Oh, my God. Wow. Cut his life into pieces. <laughs> this is his last resort. Oh, what's up, dog? What up, man? What's up, bro? Welcome. Dude, thank oh, you. Oh. This, is, this is good. You yeah. ran out the whole place for us. Uh, yeah, special occasion, yeah. That's that money right there. I am starving. You ever had Korean food before? Korean barbecue. Okay. Where? We about to try some different things. Uh, Do you F with the gnarly food? Like mid gnarly. I'll, I'll meet you at gnar. Like I'll, I'll do I'll like halfway. And I know how to use chopsticks. I'm not one of those guys that used to put like the paper in the middle. Oh, you're a cultured white. Hey. <laughs> Speaking you. of things I f with. You f with the soju? I do. Oh, thank you. Soju was like a slow creeper. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. Like the shit just kind of tastes like water. It's one of those when you get up to go to the bathroom, you're like, oh, and you realize you're in the middle of the street. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dude, thanks for having me. Let's go. Mm-hmm. What's the craziest thing you've eaten on the road while doing stand up? When I was in Minnesota, I actually did another show with Thrillist. Shout out to Insta Chef. I ate a blood cube. Oh! It was in noodles. Mm -hmm. But they don't tell you that. So I was so <laughs> psyched up on the car ride there. I pictured a Tide Pod with like blood in it. But it's just like, it was like a little salt cube. We went literally zero to 1,000 here. <laughs> We're not done yet. We got one more star of the situation. I am so nervous. This anticipation is killing me. Tell us everything, please. What was this? So that is called sea squirt. Sea squirt. Yeah. Uni. Uni, sea yeah. Urchin. Love it. Monkfish liver. Monkfish yes. liver. Uh-huh. <laughs> Raw Swiss sauce shrimp. And abalone. You see it over there. Oh, ah, that's what yeah. that is? We're There's, just eating this in front of the family right now? They're yeah. just posted up watching us just go to town yeah. on the relative. Yeah. And for the main part, yes. calabat, kamachi, salmon, flounder, and this is Toro. Oh, oh, yes. oh, you got oh, Toro. Yeah. That's, that's the good part, stuff. Right? Yeah. You know why I started eating sushi, bro? For the halibut. <laughs> Get this guy a TV show, huh? <laughs> Thank you. Let me tell you, what's coming out is killing this shit right here in, oh, yeah? in terms of uh, different. What if it's just something so basic? <laughs> it's a McDonald's McDouble. <laughs> what, where do you want to go first with this? Home. Uh, <laughs> where do you even start? I mean, this alone, this looks like the, the shit everybody used to have in their ears in high school, the, the, the gauges. <laughs> the little... I'm, I want to try this C squirt. OK. All right, let's get it. C squirt. You brave, bro. Cheers. 
I wouldn't necessarily order it. Right, right, right. But it's good. It's cool. If, if you like seafood. If you like sea squirt, you like sea squirt. You want to try some uni? A chunk of this. Oh, it just pulls right off. Yeah. Seafood sorbet. Cheers. Huh. <laughs> the texture is interesting. If you mix this in some rice, yeah. or some people do a lot of like uni pasta, fire. All right, man, well, check it out. So there's something that actually I've never tried that I've been wanting to try. Is it alive? Like, it's not dead. Okay, yeah. But it's not alive. Mm. The food that's about to come out is a drunk food in Korea, all right? Okay. All right, we can bring that out whenever you guys want. Just make sure you chew it up real good. Is this it? <gasps> oh, why the f so this right here, dog, you ready for this? Y'all are tripping. This is live octopus. So he was just back there chilling in his tank. They scooped him up, chopped him up. He was right there. Bro, why would you eat this drunk? Okay, so my man's is uh, squirming. He just got chopped up, but he's giving us premium life juice, dog. How does that work? Wait, wait, wait. So are they listening to music in there? They're like getting it, bro? He's not actually alive right now. Of course, he's dead. He got chopped up into a million pieces. What's happening is uh. it's just his nerves are still, you know, reacting. His nerves are still partying and twerking oh right now. Yeah. In Korea, it's, it's called, called still alive. It's called sanyaki. Bro, he, I don't know why he's still moving. He ain't going anywhere. Oh man, he's sticking to the leaf. All right. Dip it. Cheers, dip it. All right, and chew it up real good. Uh, uh. Cheers. All right. <laughs> it's stuck to the top, my Mm-hmm. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, I tell you, it's stuck to the roof of my mouth. Immediately. Like, he's like, bro, get me out of here. He said, please. <laughs> so some Koreans will just twirl the whole thing around their chopsticks, not even cut up, you know what I'm saying? Just like as linguine and just spin it all up and go for it. I like the sauce. This stuff was good. The sauce is good. It's chewy, it's slimy. Kind of tastes like... Hmm. This one got some real. That one's going crazy, like he's trying to escape. I mean, those suction cups, they. They, they be suctioning. <laughs> they don't, they ain't playing. That's a lot of chewing right there. I know, maybe that's why Korean's always got such a good jawline. <laughs> oh God, this shit is still moving. Yeah, take still it. Still moving. Like a G. Uh. Look at you. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh. I wanna go home. No, you love it. I actually like that one. I would say out of everything today, I like that with that sauce. Yeah, I'm gonna get some more. You know what, I think I like it because I keep going back to it. Right, there's something about it. I just wanna like, I wanna like. Mm. So I'm glad you chewed it up real good because about six people die a year trying to eat this right here. Because they don't chew it up real good. They can suffocate, tentacle, suction cups, suction into the esophagus, but you're good. I'm, I, I made it. It's yeah. already. Yeah. You are Woo. evolved. You know what wow. I'm saying? I am glad you told me that now. Because <laughs> um, I probably would have canceled had I known that. <laughs> well, hey, man. Thanks for joining me, bro. I appreciate Thanks for it. Having me, man. I feel like a more confident white guy now. Not only am I impressed with you as a person for being down to try everything, but especially as a white guy. You rep your people guy. so well right now. Yeah. But you know, at the end of the day, you just gotta open your mind, get to know different types of foods and different cultures. All right? Thanks for watching <laughs> what he said. <laughs>Yo, thanks for watching Acquired Taste. Hope you liked it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share. And make sure you tune in every week for a new episode on Thrillist.